Good morning, my people. Good morning. If you love Jesus, give me a woohoo. Woo All right, got a lot of Jesus people. I uh, was working on my yard, time to do the leaves, and uh, realized that someone stole my leaf blower out of my garage. Thank you. Thank you. I'm just about done now, thanks. That's why I have kids. Amen. But doesn't it, anyone ever had anything stolen from them? Just want to, mmm. I wish I knew who did it. Not because I would get revenge, or, um, but because I just want to go to where it is and, you, and just snatch it back. Shame on you, taking something that isn't yours. You know, we've got an enemy of our soul that takes stuff from us, desires to steal our testimony, uh, relationships, finances. Would you stand? We're going to get ready to worship. Um, but we have authority through Christ to go back like that leaf blower person and just snatch back the things that have been taken from us. That's an amen right there. We have spiritual authority to go into the enemy's camp and take back what he's stolen from us. And we're going to sing that song this morning. I went to the enemy's camp. Now, hands, fingers, up, clap them. Okay, cool. All right. That's just like a sound check. I went to the enemy's camp. Can you believe what he's done? And look at the Lord. Look what the Lord has done around. You know, when we sing that song, can you believe what the Lord has done? Look at your neighbor. Like, can you believe I'm in church? Look what the Lord has done. And confound your neighbor. Well, I went to the enemy's camp and I took back what he stole from me took back what he stole from me took back what he stole from me well i went to the enemy's camp and i took back what he stole from me and he's under my feet 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 He's under my feet. Satan is under my feet. Well, I went to the enemy's camp and I took back what he stole from me. Took back what he stole from me. Yes, I took back what he stole from me. Well, I went to the enemy's camp and I took back what he stole from me and now he's under my feet 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 satan is under my feet can you believe what the lord has done in me can you believe it can you believe what the Lord has done in me? Right here. Will he save me, cleanse me, turn my life around? Set my feet upon the solid ground. Can you believe what the Lord has done in me? Can you believe it? Can you believe what the Lord has done in me? Can you believe what the Lord has done in me? Will he save me, cleanse me, turn my life around? Set my feet upon the solid ground. Can you believe what the Lord has done in me? And look what the Lord has done. Look what the Lord has done. Well, he healed my body, he touched my mind. He saved me and it was just in time. I'm going to praise his name. Each day is just the same. Come on and praise him 
Look what the Lord has done. Come on, sing it again. Look what he's done. Well, look what the Lord has done. Look what the Lord has done. He healed my body. He touched my mind. He saved me and it was just in time. I'm going to praise his name. Each day he's just the same. Come on and praise him. Look what the Lord has done. One more time I said, look what the Lord has done. Look what the Lord has done. He healed my body. He touched my mind. He saved me and it was just in time. I'm going to praise his name. Each day he's just the same. Come on and praise him. Look what the Lord has done. Yeah, look what he's done. Woo. All right, you may be seated. Good morning, church. Good morning. Hopefully that woke everyone up. I'd like to welcome everyone to this morning to Ogama Hills Church. Um, sorry, my mind blanked. Um, in the seat backs in front of you, every couple of seats, you'll notice we have our Connect card. This is just to fill out for to let us know that you were here. On the back, there's a spot for a prayer request, or it even says praise. So if the Lord has answered a prayer for you, let us know, because that's always fun to rejoice with those when the when a prayer is answered. In your bulletin, you will see some announcements. Uh, something I want to point out today is our annual members meeting. Um, so after second service today, if you're a member, stick around. We're going to be having that meeting. You do not have to be a member to attend, but you do need to be a member to vote. Uh, another announcement. Next Sunday is the informational meeting for the Honduras mission trip. That will also be taking place after second service next week in room 20. If you're interested in going, it's a good way to find out if it's um, something that you want to do. If you don't want to go to Honduras, but you still want to reach out to the people of Honduras, they're also doing a water bottle fundraiser in the foyers, both sides. There are water bottles. Take one home, fill it up, uh, spare change, some dollar bills. Um, and they are going to be collecting those on December 2nd, and that is to raise money for the uh, water filters that they use as part of their outreach ministry while they're there in Honduras. Uh, so, yeah, and there are lots of other announcements in the bulletin, so be sure to take a look at that, find out what's going on this week in the church. Thank you, Liz. Pastor, can I make an announcement? Yes. How many served in the military? How many had a father, mother, or child serving or have served in the military? All right, that's a lot. Next Sunday um, is November 11th, you know, Veterans Day. So what we want to see is we want to see some of them handsome, pretty faces in, in uniform. It, well, not like in person. I, I won't fit in mine anymore. But uh, in, in photos. Shrunk. In photos. I didn't grow this way, but. But the, I'm, I'm a little the material wider. shrunk. You washed it. It and did. It shrunk. You know that stuff shrinks. It's terrible. Um, but if you've got a photo of yourself, if you were a veteran or uh, of a family member, we want to show them off next Sunday. So you can, if you bring them to the church, we're going to display them in the entryway as you, people kind of come in. So if you got photos like that, bring them in. We really want to see them. Thank you, Lon. Sounds good. Yeah, special day next week. Um, any of you men ever get hungry? Nah. I currently am. Right, right. <laughs> Lonnie could go for some pancakes right now. Uh, yeah, this coming Saturday is uh, men's breakfast at 8 a.m. here at the church. Uh, and we know it's hunting season, but if you could make it out uh, Saturday morning, um, if you uh, choose to not use a bow and you'd rather shoot it with a rifle, come out Saturday morning. And uh, we're going to have uh, breakfast together and a great time uh, from 8 o'clock till 9 o'clock Saturday. So we always look forward to that. So come on out and have a great breakfast together here at the church. At this time, we're going to turn our attention to Christ in worship and ask you to stand with me, please. Church is about Jesus. Amen? Church is about Jesus. Uh, not about me, not about you. We try to make everything we do about him. 
And now anytime we're around him, he blesses us. And we know that that's, that's his heart and his nature. He likes to take care of us and just bless us in uh, so many ways. Uh, but church isn't about getting blessed or receiving from him. It's about giving to him. He's the head of the church, the Bible tells us. And so we come to worship him. And as Jesus says, we're to worship him in spirit and in truth. So it's a God thing even for us to worship him in a right manner. And so we're going to turn our attention back to him now as we enter back into worshiping through song and the gift from the Lord of music. Uh, we're going to worship as we give in a little bit. We'll worship as we pray throughout the service. We'll worship as we hear his word and respond in faith to his word and what he calls us to. But we want to express what he's worth to us this morning as we gather. So let's pray and prepare our hearts to do so. Lord, we have nothing to offer you. You are everything. You are the creator. You are all powerful. You are the one who holds all things together. But yet, Lord, we as an expression of your creation, you've put your spirit within us and you've called us to come and, and shine brightly for you. And so this morning, God, we want to sing praises to your name. We want to worship you and we invite you to come and be here among us. We come as a needy people, but Lord, First and foremost, we want to give to you and offer you a right uh, expression of worship. We love you, Lord, and we want to express that as we sing. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, worship his holy name, sing like never before, oh my soul, I'll worship your holy name. The sun comes up, it's a new day dawning. It's time to sing your song again. Whatever may pass and whatever lies before me. Let me be singing when the evening comes. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, worship his holy name, sing like never before, oh my soul, I'll worship your holy name. You're rich in love and you're slow to anger. Your name is great and your heart is kind. For all your goodness I will keep on singing. Ten thousand reasons for my heart to find. So bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, worship his holy name, sing like never before, oh my soul, I'll worship your holy On that day when my strength is failing, the end draws near and my time has come. Still my soul will sing your praise unending. Yes. Ten thousand years and then forevermore. Oh, forevermore. To bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, 
worship His holy name. Sing like never before, oh my soul, I'll worship Your holy name. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, worship His holy name. Sing like never before, oh my soul, I worship your holy name. Lord, I worship, I worship your holy name. Lord, I worship your holy name. sing like never before. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Lord, from my soul I worship. My heart's cry is to say thank you for the things that you've done. Jesus, thank you for you, the cross. Thank you for carrying my burden. You were despised and rejected. Should have been me. But you defeated death. You defeated hell. You are victorious over the grave so that I am too. Thank you, Lord. Alone in my sorrow and dead in my sin. Lost without hope, with no place to begin. Your love made a way to let mercy come in. When death was arrested and my life began, yes. Ash was redeemed, only beauty remained. My orphan heart was given a name. My morning grew quiet, my feet rose to dance. When death was arrested and my life began. Oh, your grace so free. Washes over me. You have made me new. Now life begins with you. Released from my chains, I'm a prisoner no more. My shame was a ransom he faithfully bore. He canceled my debt, and he called me his friend. Oh, yes, he did. When death was arrested in my life began. Oh, your grace so free washes over me. You have made me new. Now life begins with you. your endless love pouring down on us you have made us new now life begins with you our savior display on a criminal's cross Darkness rejoiced as though heaven had lost. But then Jesus arose with our freedom in hand. Yes, he did. That's when death was arrested in my life began. That's when death was arrested in 
my life began. Oh, your grace so free washes over me. You have made me new. Now life begins with you. It's your endless love pouring down on Of all the redeemed, yes, we're free, free forever, amen. When death was arrested in my life began, oh, we're free, free forever, we're free. Come join the soul of all the redeemed, yes, we're free, free forever, amen. When death was arrested in my life began, when death was arrested. And my life began, that's when death was arrested, and my life began. Thank you, Jesus. You serve a good God, an awesome God. Lord, be blessed by our praise. Amazing love that welcomes me. The kindness of mercy that bought with blood wholeheartedly my soul undeserving sings God God you're so good God you're so good God you're so good you're so good to me. Behold the cross, H-U-H, and our by our word. The dead are sinner saved the work of your power God you're so good God you're so good God you're so good you're so good to Sing it again, God. God, God you're, so you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. You're so good to me. I am blessed. I am called. I am healed, I am whole, I am saved in Jesus' name. Highly favored, anointed, filled with your power for the glory of Jesus' name. I am blessed, come on, tell her. I am blessed, I am called, I am healed, I am whole, I am saved in Jesus' name, highly favored, anointed, filled with your power for the glory 
of Jesus' name. And should this life bring suffering, Lord, I will remember what Calvary has bought for me both now and forever and God you're so good God you're so good God you're so good you're so good to me oh god you're good god you're so good god you're so good god you're so good you're so Tell him again, God, you're good. Say, God, you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. You're so good to me. I am blessed. I am called. I am healed, I am whole, I am saved in Jesus' name. Highly favored, anointed, filled with your power for the glory of Jesus' name. I am blessed, I am called, I am healed, I am whole, I am saved in Jesus' name, highly favored, anointed, filled with your power for the glory of Jesus' name. Let's sing it, church. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so good, you're so good to me. Say it again. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. Lord, you are forever good. And God, we acknowledge your eternal goodness now. And sometimes we can see it readily and sometimes we can't, and that doesn't change a thing. God, you're good. You're so good. And help us, Lord, when this life brings suffering, that we would be mindful of all that Calvary has bought us, all that the cross of Jesus Christ has purchased for us. God, you're so good. Let your goodness permeate our lives, and may we be good in return. We thank you, Lord. We praise you. God, as we give in just a moment, when we express your goodness, God, we want to say thank you. We want to make a statement of faith that everything we are, everything we have is yours. So, Lord, we give with expectation that you can move through what we've entrusted to your care in ways that we could never do on our own. Lord, feed the hungry. Clothe the naked. Bring the gospel to the, the poor and the hurting and the lonely. God, reach people in desperate need right here in our town. And reach people in desperate need 
around the world, Lord, with ministries we partner with in Asia and the Middle East, Lord, in Central and South America. Lord, we thank you and we're humbled by you. We love you, Lord. Thank you, God, for the ability to, to partner with these, these sweet children, these sweet infants that are abandoned and orphaned in Kenya. Lord, thank you for the work you're doing through this church thousands and thousands of miles away. God, you are so, so good. So bless this offering. We give it with an attitude of worship that it may be acceptable in your sight. We praise you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You may be seated.